आर्मी लाइफ फॉर अ पर्सन फ्रॉम आउटसाइड आर्मी लाइफ में सीम टू बी वेरी वेरी रोजी बट बींग एन आर्मी वाइफ इज अ वेरी चैलेंजिंग थिंग बिकॉज एवरी टू ईयर्स समटाइम्स नॉट इवन टू ईयर्स एंड इफ यू लुक एट द कैरियर इट इज इट रियली गोज फॉर अ टॉक टू ईयर्स यू कम यू ट्राई टू ज्वाइन अव न्यू ऑर्गेनाइजेशन यू आर अव कमर है चाहे आपके पीछे आठ दस साल के एक्सपीरियंस होगा Singh, I welcome you to read my story where I interview authors, speakers, coaches, celebrities, entrepreneurs, and more. Today I have with me Dr. Kalpana V. She has done a bachelor's in veterinary and animal sciences from the College of Veterinary and Animal Sciences, uh, Munutri, Jichur, Kerala. Soon after completing her degree, she got married to an army officer. Being an army wife means you should be ready to pack your bag and move any time. Soon the home front, she has to take uh, the lead, but at the back of her mind, she always Always wanted to work and do something in her life. So when her husband had a field uh, posting, she enrolled herself for a diploma in education under government of Kerala. Thus, uh, she became a primary school teacher. She worked in government school for one year. During subsequent postings, she worked in various army schools for almost four years. Destiny still had other plans for her. Her husband got posted in Delhi. Here, she joined hands with her friend and started a company, the Culprish Education Services, and uh, now. she is a full time entrepreneur for helping preschool in promoting holistic development they launched an uh, educational box that includes workbook and skill enhancers for children aged between uh, 3 to 6 years so today she will be discussing with us about her life journey so uh, let us hear from her welcome kalpana the platform is open and now over to you Thank you so much for giving me such a wonderful opportunity to share my journey with uh, with the people, uh, with the audience. Right. Thank you so much. Thank you, and looking forward to it. So, if I uh, ask you about yourself, how did your past life has affected the person who you wanted to be in your life, and what you are? Uh, thank you so much for this question, uh, because uh, my uh, this is a very apt question for me, because my life had taken so much of twists and turn uh, that, uh, and I feel that at each stage of my life. Uh, I was being prepared uh, to do what I am doing now. Right. As a student, I was a very hard working and diligent. And uh, this quality of being hard working, diligent, and uh, had uh, is very important for becoming if you want to become an entrepreneur. So right. this has been through uh, been with me all throughout my life. So since childhood, I was uh, so this has been one quality which is uh, which is uh, helping me to helping me in becoming a good entrepreneur. Right. All owing to my uh, army background, uh, I had uh, since I. married an army officer i have got the opportunity to travel and meet so many people that uh, i am able to judge people uh, and i have i i have experienced so much of i have uh, seen so people with so many experiences and all this has added uh, up to my personality so uh, which is also very important for a, uh, an entrepreneur because i understand people uh, when they say something because i know their culture the from where they are coming what what they are thinking all these things so uh, this has also helped me to become a, a become a, and uh, entrepreneur so this is it <laughs> so when you were growing what kind of thoughts you had uh, about choosing a career um frankly speaking uh, teaching was not my first choice i intended to be a doctor maybe just because as you know in our households people are like you should be a doctor or an engineer or all, all these things since i was not a, not a very math student i thought that a uh, doctor uh, becoming a doctor is my aim in life so i was right. working towards uh, after my 12th standard i gave my entrance and i got through for for uh, veterinary science okay. so i studied for most six years uh, in a way my dream was to fill that i became a doctor but while studying uh, i understood that this is not the place uh, right place for me and uh, you can call it fortunately i got married to an army officer and then i could uh, put the blame on him that since he is <laughs> he is i could not right. take up a job okay. so i uh, also i wanted to start a family because being an army officer it's not always that you get to stay with your uh, husband so whenever uh, i thought that I should move with him. Uh, whenever I get an opportunity, I stay with him because if they, if it is a field posting, then you'll have to uh, stay. Correct. So I joined him. Then the next uh, eight years, it was like uh, I uh, we started a family, and it was like children uh, settling them 
setting in a new place, moving, packing, all these things were happening uh, with me. Well, can you repeat the question once again? So you did not get uh, the, much of the opportunities which you had in your mind, like uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I didn't uh, never actually I didn't have the time to even think about my career. But uh, I was I uh, but uh, every day so it used to pinch me that then I study and I am not doing anything. I am not doing anything. It is not just not the right days for me. Sitting at home, sitting at home. When my husband, uh, he was not, uh, he was also not very happy that I am at home. So I wanted to uh, do something, do something. Then uh, there was a chance meeting with one of my neighbor when we were posted at a post. She told me that how she shifted from pharmacy to teach. You want to do anything? Army wives are the best job is you because Correct. the schools are very bare. You get a job easily. You need not do out of the cantonment. Uh, so uh, so I also gave it a thought that I'll also try. It. Okay, I'll try to uh, shift to teaching. Push to ho jaye. That's how. Right. So, in, fr- in, frankly, that's how I shifted to teaching. Right. So she told me that there is a course. Since I did a professional course, I won't be able to do. I was not able to do a bachelor degree, a bachelor in education. Right. So I had to do a diploma. Also. So I uh, I thought that okay, I'll give it a uh, give it a try. And I uh, then I uh, scouted for the courses in Kerala. This was in February. And by March, I got to know that by March the new course was about to start. Okay. Also, since I was uh, by that time I was almost thirty five, so it was uh, age over for me. Uh, you, know, you can join the course only till thirty three years, so it was okay. a big struggle again. I had to fight. I had to give so much of uh, application to the government, uh, going to the government officers, uh, officers. Even my husband had come. We went and we uh, we uh, represented our case there. So they also felt that being an army officer's wife, it's not to have to do that. So I got admission for a uh, uh, diploma in education. Right. In uh, near my uh, hometown, so I shifted my children also to get admission there, uh, and then I joined uh, that course. But uh, frankly speaking, that was the best thing which could have happened to because I, even though I was motivated, I had to the world that uh, because people were not uh, very convinced. कि ये doctorate करके फिर अभी ये चलवाने के ऐसे ये diploma करके बाहर ये different field. Yes, and सब ऐसे मुझे चिढ़ाते थे कि अच्छा ये पहली बार हम देख रहे हैं कि कोई IAS का पढ़ के आया है और अभी APC की पढ़ने के लिए कर गार्डन में आके बैठी है. So all these things I had to uh, hear. Uh, it was not very easy, but never I was demotivated. I was very. मुझे ऐसे लगता था रे इनको पता नहीं मेरे लिए कितना बड़ा opportunity खुला हुआ है. It is such a great road ahead for me. Uh, even the teachers there were younger to me, and the girls who used to study with me, they were just uh, 17 plus uh, 17 year old girls. So for them, I was their buddy TV, and I used to organize. But my organizational skills, my confidence, everything. Uh, I really. Discovered everything uh, in during that time. So um, I think uh, actually I was made to be a. Uh, that's right. what I understood after that. Great, wonderful. So if I talk about things you are passionate about in your life, so what are those things? Uh huh. If you ask me about uh, things I am passionate about, I am passionate about teaching uh, preschool uh, children. Uh, I'm saying preschool children because uh, for uh, for a preschool for a preschool child, uh, if you see a small uh, kindergarten child, you are like the Second mother to the child. One who leaves the school, one leaves the home. Then, baki wo uh, ma'am ho ko ek hope ke saath aata hai. Correct. So you can influence them. They are like a, they are like clay. You can influence them so much that you have got so much power to mold them in the way you want want to. Thoda bade ho jaate hain primary level me a jaate hain to wo thoda sa question karna start kar lete hain. It is not like that. But kindergarten children are like uh, they are like uh, they are so innocent. They are so you forget all your worries, everything when you are with uh, the with those children. yeah you need a lot of energy you have to physically jump with them run with them cry with them laugh with them everything is there but uh, the kind of influence you can do to uh, uh, in their life uh, is too much so i'm very passionate about teaching uh, kindergarten children right. and i used to feel that i have got them only for 3 to 4 hours jitna ho sakta hai main usko unko padha un padhao unko samjhao unko hold karu aise feeling hota tha mera so right. i'm very passionate about that uh, the next thing i am passionate is about uh, reading Uh, uh, I was a good reader. I used to read books. I still read books. Uh, so in India, if you see, छोटे बच्चों की पढ़ाई के बारे में uh, it's not very uh, people are not very aware. Uh, if you see, there are uh, things are changing. Things are changing for the good. Uh, there are uh, if you see the uh, children's books at all. I actually got into this for my son when he was small. So I was scouting for books for my son. I could not find. ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा जो मिलता था it was like Amar Chitra Katha. So that is not for small children. For three to सिख वाले बच्चों के लिए नहीं है जस्ट थोड़ा सा बड़ा बड़े एज के लिए सो आई कुड 
of time so i finally had to uh, i really did a good research and i used to buy books uh, and all were foreign publication books and lately ye thoda jab bada hone ka start ho gaya to tulika pratham jaise english public indian publications bhi aa gaye hain and i am very passionate about uh, those books i have a great library i can start a library because i have almost 10000 to 20000 books with me uh, ye, ye, children's books children's books uh, because uh, man uh, the kind of the kind of knowledge you get from that uh, because simple things uh, simple morals in uh, of life they have said in a very funny way in those uh, books through illustration so i am very passionate about uh, reading uh, i in fact uh, wherever i have uh, worked as a teacher i have set up library my principals ko mai batati thi ki please give me the just power to do something i'll set up the library akele mai kar lunga uh, i have been very fortunate that uh, principals have also helped me uh, that given me the power of theek hai jo karna hai aap kar lo even in classrooms i have set up uh, i used to set up a library for me uh, for python jo small publications like magic pot ke hota tha i used to hang it jaise thread ke sath jaise hum uh, clothes hang karne ke liye karte the right. aise main books chaku bhi dal deti thi so children used to uh, even after free in, during their free time after lunch and all they used to go and akele apne aap kele the chahe unko padhna aaye na aaye but they, they uh, i i have i was very fast passionate to so, bacche books leke baith jate the mere class mein okay. so i am very passionate about reading and the next thing is uh, traveling uh, and i was fortunate that i got married to an army officer so i could pursue my passion uh, very we have done a, quite a few road trips from kashmir to kerala and we have traveled like that uh, since i'm very passionate about that uh, uh, we used to do road trips so it, uh, it was quite a very exciting journey exciting right that is really uh, awesome so if i uh, talk about your work and experiences like you have already mentioned some of the uh, things but i'd like to know more on to it like how you uh, got into a job what all you did and uh, how you started your business and what all you doing uh, in your business as well okay thank you yeah. now after as i had mentioned earlier after my 12th i joined uh, the veterinary uh, bachelor of veterinary and animal sciences uh, right. institute manuti is one of the most prestigious colleges uh, in uh, kerala there are only two veterinary colleges and i joined it. so after that course i told you i was not made for that i felt like that so so i then i uh, shifted to diploma in education like that uh, and then after that i joined uh, joined the work joined work i worked in a government school in kerala so that was a great eye opener for me i got to know about uh, uh, the, the the policies which the government uh, is, uh, is has made for children like okay. sarva shiksha abhiyan uh, all these things i got to uh, i got to know since i worked at all right then uh, from uh, from there then i joined my husband and then i joined many uh, army school so it was a totally different environment there mm, uh, so uh, i worked in a few army schools in uh, sikandarabad rajasthan and all and then he got posted to delhi so i felt that um, instead of uh, instead of uh, uh, while coming to delhi i thought that i'll take a sabbatical for about one year because it was covid times and my son right. was in nine and i wanted to uh, settle him down because if i start working then it is like you are again caught up in that uh, morning to evening you are engaged in your work so i True. thought i thought of taking a sabbatical and then uh, that's when my friend also joined me was working with me in rajasthan we were colleagues there she also got posted in delhi and she also joined the, she also got uh, shifted to delhi so she was searching for a job in school but i had i was very clear that i'm going to take up so uh, but she told me uh, kalpana why don't we uh, see uh, we have done so much in school uh, because during uh, we when we were working in rajasthan it was uh, we were doing the coordinators me and my friend so uh, it was then that covid struck if you see covid aane ke baad rules to matlab schools mein pata nahi chal raha tha karna kya hai kaise hona hai True. so and when it comes to pre school nobody was even thinking about pre school ki ke bhi class chalane hai but we were such we our school in our school ye march mein hua tha lockdown we started april mein ye classes start hone the we started our classes uh, whatsapp wala jo videos bana ke bhejna ye sab humne humne khud apne idea se hi hum dono ne start kar liya hamare school mein april 1st se hi pre school mein bhi classes start ho gaye jabki june july tak log soch rahe the ki kya karna hai kya karna hai online web platform ye karna hai cisco webex aa rahi hai microsoft teams aa rahi hai ye sab chal rahi thi jabki pre school mein kuch nahi ho raha tha our classes had started and we had started making worksheets and we had started sending them to children so she told me see kalpana we did so many things there uh, why not uh, if you join us over here we will be able to spend only a small set of chips so if you do something uh, if we start something which we uh, through which we can influence a lot of children why not go for that so that thing really excited me right yeah that yeah that's right if we start something hame hame jab hum padhate the hame bahut sari cheeze aise lagti thi 
थी कि ये भी होना चाहिए ऐसे भी होना चाहिए ऐसे भी होना चाहिए सो इंस्टेड ऑफ जस्ट क्रिबिंग अरे ये तो ऐसे तो स्कूल में नहीं है गवर्नमेंट की पॉलिसी ऐसे है ये सो वी है ये चीज चाहिए वो चीज चाहिए इंस्टेड ऑफ जस्ट क्रिबिंग दैट दिस थिंग इज नॉट देर दैट थिंग इज नॉट देर गवर्नमेंट की ये पॉलिसी है वो पॉलिसी है वी कैन वी शुड डू समथिंग सो दैट सो दैट दीज थिंग्स दीज प्रॉब्लम आर सॉल्व सो वी दैट्स हाउ वी वी डिसाइडेड दैट वी स्टार्ट समथिंग वी मेक वर्कशीट वी मेक इन एनहेंस फॉर चिल्ड्रन सो दैट इट द वर्क ऑफ टीचर्स ऑल्सो बिकम इजी एंड चिल्ड्रन आर ऑल्सो एंगेज वेरी पॉजिटिवली इन द क्लास रूम सो वी स्टार्टेड ऑफ विद इट एंड वी वेयर अ ग्रेट टीम वेन वी वर वर्किंग टूगेदर सो इट वॉज नॉट वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर मी वी आई नो आई न्यू हर ऑल्सो वेरी वेल शी नोज मी देर आर देर आर सम स्ट्रेंथ देर आर सम सम स्ट्रेंथ माई स्ट्रेंथ इज देर सम थिंग्स शी इज वेरी कॉन्फिडेंट केपेबल सो वी विद इन वन ईयर वी वर्क सो हार्ड दैट वी मेड अबाउट थाउजेंड कॉपीज ऑफ thousand boxes for nursery lkg lkg which Great. has got a lot of uh, which has got workbooks which has got a lot of skill enhancers with in that uh, and uh, we have been supplying to schools we have got almost four schools now uh, we were we launched quite late uh, by march uh, because by that time schools decide take a decision on uh, which books to go over. but right. our, uh, maybe our product was that good even after being late we were uh, almost four schools have taken our stuff wonderful it's much better by next year that's great since you are on the initial stage like struggle is huge initially once you are yeah. established and you have uh, some sign offs with you of the schools then it is easy to adopt uh, by other schools also and uh, yes, any yes. plans to uh, do it like uh, direct to customer as well like parents yeah yeah uh, so our customer base if you see our main target is schools only we are planning for bulk orders but uh, we have also started a website on the product since the first day itself because we feel that once children if you see they are in school for only 3 to 4 hours rest of the time children are at home correct it is under the it is under it is the it is on the parent to decide how to manage his time so uh, so that's why we have made these boxes and we have included it in such we have made it in such a way that we have given a curriculum we have given a schedule for the parents also to follow ki uh, april mahine mein kya kya padhana hai is pe kya kya skill sets dene hain may ke mahine mein kya kya padhana hai all these things also we have given uh, in that so that a teacher can also be can also act as a uh, teacher when a parent can also act as a teacher even in right. the workbooks we have structured in such a way that the that a parent who is not very aware how to go about it can also handle it uh, because we feel that after school hours we hum after school enrichment jo bolte hain so right. after school uh, enrichment is also very important this can help the child in school agar acche se after school hours ko utilize kare to bacche ko uh, bacche ko matlab wo class hours mein bahut help ho jayega for example if you are in a preschool child ke liye likhna writing is a very difficult task right. so when he is back home if you give activities for promoting his fine motor skills hote hain jo small muscles of uh, fingers jo hai usko promote karne wale activities like coloring with uh, coloring with crayons and uh, lacing activities cutting activity ye karayenge so it will become easy for him to write when he is in school that's right. so that's why we have made uh, we have made it in such a way that uh, uh, read, uh, parents customers can also buy directly from our uh, website wonderful that is really wonderful because Engaging uh, with kids at a early stage uh, can help yes. grow their uh, overall overall perspective. Uh, mainly uh, okay. mind development of a child that is really important. Okay. Great. So if I talk about your vision, mission, and goal uh, for next five to ten years from now, what do you think uh, your plans are? So my vision, if you see, uh, is to improve the quality of preschool education in uh, in India. Uh, now things are changing. Uh, initially, preschool education it was it was in it Uh, it was not at all given importance in uh, in the indian context uh, if you see still it is not uh, still it is not standardized uh, but now with the national education policy the uh, preschool education is also being formalized so i hope that things will change for good so my uh, my vision in li- in uh, for the next 5 10 years is that like formal uh, like pre- primary education uh, class 1 se jo padhai hoti hai waise hi preschool education will also have a very standardized uh, education in india that is what i feel Uh, that is my uh, vision uh, and if you see my mission uh, uh, my mission uh, is to educate the people
people about holistic development for preschool children. Holistic right. development means overall development. It is not just A B C D one to T kaga ga. It is right. not at all that. That is the last priority if you if you, uh, if you consider for a preschool child. More important skills is social skills. The child should be emotionally stable. A motor skills, a hands, but the fine motor, the small muscles of the hands be developed. His gross motor skill, heel na, heel na, tooth na. ये सारी चीजें प्रमोट करनी कॉग्नेटिव स्किल्स बिकॉज कॉग्नेटिव स्किल्स मतलब पजल सॉल्व करना द चाइल्ड दिस इज द टाइम वेन ऑल दी स्किल्स शुड बी शुड बी डेवलप टूगेदर इन अ चाइल्ड देन फाइनली वील गेट टू आर नो की इसमें से कौन सा बच्चे को पसंद है दैट देर आर in the box other activities also and edu- trying to educate people about uh, them wonderful so uh, now moving on to the next one if i talk about the most important life lessons you have learned from your personal and professional journey so far so what do you think uh, your learnings would be uh-huh. uh, if you see uh, one of the thing which i from my life which i have learned is that circumstances don't uh, don't wait for the right circumstance to something unless you cheer your journey things won't fall uh, in प्लेस को ही तो जस्ट थिंक वाइल्ड ड्रीम वाइल्ड मुझे ये करना है मुझे मुझे एस्ट्रोनॉट uh, बनना है जस्ट थिंक लाइक जस्ट हैव अ वाइल्ड थॉट एंड वाइल्ड थॉट एंड बिलीव इन इट जस्ट द यूनिवर्स विल कंस्पायर एंड मेक थिंग्स सुटेबल फॉर यू एंड यू विल बी एबल टू डू बिकॉज व्हेन आई वाज अ व्हेन आई जॉइंट माय हस्बैंड आई वाज अ वेटनरी डॉक्टर एंड आई वाज नॉट श्योर कि कैसे मैं टीचर बनूंगी uh, तो uh, uh, अरे नहीं ये तो नहीं हो पाएगा मेरे लिए तो ये जर्नी क्लोज है ऐसे ही मुझे लगा I had that in mind. So this mindset of a teacher and mindset of a veterinary doctor is entirely a different thing. True. Uh, even जो हम मेरे mother in law आई is very very much into this Jyoti Bishan and all that. Okay. So she used to she used to uh, she used to say नहीं नहीं तुम्हारे कुल्ली में लिखा हुआ है कि you will be you will be a teacher. So I thought thought कि नहीं नहीं ये तो ये तो मतलब पता नहीं ये ये जो भी है ये गलत बोला है करके. Right. But I I I am surprised that finally became a teacher uh, because I had that thought in mind and I. Uh, um, इससे ऐसे ऐसे लोगों को भी मेरे लाइफ में लेकर आ गए कि फाइनली आई फाइनली आई कुड डू दैट आई आई बिकेम अ टीचर सो एंड एंड आल्सो आई टुक दैट अपॉर्चुनिटी विद भरतपुर से शिफ्ट होना बच्चों को लेके इट वाज इट वाज नॉट एट ऑल अ इजी इजी थिंग फॉर मी बट आई टुक द ग्रैब ऑन टू द अपॉर्चुनिटी एंड आई शिफ्टेड टू केरला एंड आई डिड दिस सो सरकमस्टेंसेस वोंट फॉल कम योर वे यू हैव टू चेंज द कोर्स ऑफ द जर्नी सो दैट यू फाइनली एंड अप व्हाट यू वांट आल्सो इट इज अ वेरी क्लीशे टर्म बिलीव इन योर सेल्फ बिलीव इन योर सेल्फ ये हमें बहुत सुना हुआ है सो आई ऑल्सो यूज टू थिंक क्या है ये बिलीव इन योर सेल्फ या दैट इज अट इज अट इज अ वेरी वेरी इट इज अ वेरी एक्चुअली दैट मीन्स दैट यू हैव टू बिलीव इन योर स्ट्रेंथ दैट आई एम केपेबल ऑफ डूइंग दिस आई कैन डू दिस देन द काइंड ऑफ कॉन्फिडेंस यू कैट ना यू विल बी एबल टू डू एनीथिंग यू विल बी एबल ऑन कर द वर्ल्ड बिकॉज वेन वी गॉट इन टू दिस ऑन्टरप्रेनरशिप एवरी वन यूज टू सेल यू से दैट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू सेल योर प्रोडक्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू शुड बिलीव इन योर प्रोडक्ट अदरवाइज यू वोट बी एबल टू डू So we, after launching our product, we had gone for a few exhibitions. So in some exhibitions, the response was good, but in some we uh, we uh, uh, because the customer base was not like that, not for the kind of people who wanted this. So we uh, we but we never doubted our product because we believed in our work. We believed in our product. So that believe in yourself, believe in what you are doing is very important. Otherwise, you won't be able to achieve uh, anything in life. And the third thing is we we always stick on to core values in life. Every person should. have some core values and like honest hard work being on time you should uh, you should stick on to this core values uh, that then only you will be able to be uh, then, uh, that's why i am able to run a very ethical correct otherwise otherwise if you don't have that core values hame ko value system nahi hai na to bahut aise situations aayenge are theek hai yaar kar lete hain kar lete hain matlab kuch galat kar lete hain no you should have that you should be strong person from inside and i chahe kuch bhi ho jaye ye jo core values hai main inko 
H O P like that. Then only you will be uh, you will be able to su- be successful. Definitely. And fourth and last point is be genuine. Be genuine. Genuine. Genuinity. Uh, self. Actually, now the world is full of so much of uh, with the social media coming in our life. Genuinity has been really lost uh, in this mad rush. So uh, try to be a very genuine person. आज कल जेनुइन लोग बहुत कम मिलते हैं सो इफ यू कैन बी अ जेनुइन पर्सन यू विल स्टैंड आउट अबाउट टू ट्राई टू बी अ जेनुइन पर्सन राइट एंड यू राइटली पॉइंटेड आउट ऑल दीज थिंग्स आर रियली इंपॉर्टेंट लाइक ग्रैबिंग एन अपॉर्चुनिटी और मे बी एक्सप्लोरिंग एन अपॉर्चुनिटी वुड बी द राइट वर्ड सो दैट इज रियली इंपॉर्टेंट अनलेस अनटिल अनलेस यू ट्राई योर सेल्फ यू वुड नॉट फाइंड दी अपॉर्चुनिटी दैट इज वन थिंग एंड यू ऑल्सो मैंशन दैट यू वर अ डॉक्टर बट यू गॉट इन टू अ डिफरेंट जर्नी ऑल टूगेदर एंड यू स्टडीड एट द एज ऑफ 35 and you uh, choose the career which was uh, not at all was a cup cup of uh, tea for you and uh, yeah. you choose that field you did good and uh, you explore things so that you can change uh, life of many many uh, little ones so that they can develop their overall perspective their overall uh, mindset uh, ready for education and uh, the struggle of life that is really wonderful thing and being genuine and being uh, like uh, following a process principles uh, pr- Uh, being genuine that is really important because these are core values which makes you strong not only strong makes you uh, really work well in life because uh, that is how you manage things personally and professionally both and that is really important great so uh, now moving on to the next one like you being a army wife uh, you have uh, seen so much uh, struggle in your life choosing a career shifting to different places your uh, kids education and so and so forth so i'd like to no more on to it what kind of struggle you have faced and other women uh, facing from the defense background yeah army life uh, for a person from outside army life may seem to be very uh, very rosy right. for an uh, a person outside the army may feel that army wife ke to balle balle hai they have got this they have got that they can travel they can this they can that all these things um, but uh, being an army wife is a very challenging thing uh, because every 2 years uh, sometimes not even 2 years you will have to uh, you have to move you have to change you have to uh, pack you have to settle in new place and uh, and in uh, and in some cases when your husband is not there to help you out you will have to do all the packing uh, yourself uh, you have to arrange for everything uh, and you will have to uh, move your, on your own uh, right also uh, in some cases i told you once you are once you have settled in a place by uh, you must have uh, that too when you come to a new place you tend to you you stay in a mess for right. about 2 months then you move to a temporary accommodation for about 3 months uh, and then you move to a, a permanent accommodation you should think that this is within 2 years okay uh, and uh, and while packing you have to do so much of planning ki mess mein jab rahenge ye ye box aap khulegi jab hum uh, temporary mein jayenge ye ye box aap khulenge right. and then when you are in so it is so much it is so difficult uh, with small children on to ek aapke god mein hogi ek aapke haath mein honge aur inko leke you are like uh, uh, you are doing all these hello correct so it is very uh, it is very difficult, uh, very difficult for a uh, army wife True. you should have a very uh, positive attitude towards life yeah there are uh, there are benefits also you you get to you uh, you become a very tough person uh, from inside uh, you get to uh, interact with so many people that you your personality is changed as a whole uh, if you say mere mere life mein agar bologe before christ after christ to hai waise before marriage after marriage my life i i am a totally different person. because the one is from i am from a south indian state where uh, where the things are very different uh, we mm-hmm. have got that language bar- different barrier also uh, we are not very comfortable in hindi mm-hmm. so it was very difficult for me the climatic issues are there uh, that is one thing which your army wife has to again uh, endure in some places it is very cold in some places it is very mm-hmm. humid type so every two years you are shifting with children to bachche bimar padte hain so all these things are there which is very difficult mm-hmm. and if you look at the cat Career, it is. It really goes for a talk. Correct. You won't be able to make anything out of you uh, because two years you come, you try to join a new event, uh, new organization. You are a newcomer. Then, चाहे आपके पीछे आठ दस साल के experience होगा, but when you join an organization, you are a newcomer. These things really hinder your growth as your uh, in professional life. Be ready to take uh, take all these things in your stride. Don't take it in that way. Just I feel you just take it that you are becoming a better person. You are you are being uh, you are being ready. Face the challenge. challenges of life better than those outside the army right so that's what i think uh, felt about army all the army wise have facing issues so that is also one more mission from my 
by entrepreneurship we have been giving employment to army wives okay. when are uh, in our books even in our books uh, a few army wives have designed the things for us one is one is sitting in pathan court the other one is sitting in uh, dinjan in northeast okay. so uh, we are trying to break that barrier uh, we are give, trying to give opportunity for army wives uh, through our pen. that is really wonderful like people is staying uh, at different places working together yeah. so covid have taught so many things and this is one of the best one yes that is that that really has uh, given actually this has given a lot of things for army wives uh, many of them are doing film marketing uh, because now there are many online jobs which uh, which you can do yeah, so this has been a boom covid correct. has been um, a boom some of uh, the army wives i know they have started like uh, consultancy business or maybe teaching online training programs also they have started yeah. coaching online yeah. coaching also they have started and yeah, yeah, yeah. so that is yeah, really yeah. wonderful so if i talk about career uh, as a whole uh, how difficult it is to choose uh, a career of your choice and what challenges are there if you see if you see the career uh, told you initially i was also in a denial that i would be doing teaching so the normal uh, uh, to normal army wives jo karte hain they won't be doing that but uh, finally i understood that if i want to work uh, this is the only thing i can do because you are staying alone with your family there is no other support for you so you have to right. take care of your children also so teaching is one job jo aap bachcho ke sath chale jao and bachcho ke sath wapas aate so uh, even if there is no Nobody back home. You don't have a problem in that. Correct. So uh, for an army wife, I think teaching is a good job, a good op, a good job which they can pick up. But yeah, they teaching is not everyone's uh, cup of tea. Uh, everyone Correct. cannot be a, a good teacher. But, but as you as we discussed earlier, now the opportunities have opened up for army wives also uh, on the online platform. So people are um, uh, taking up jobs other than uh, teaching. But if you consider my case, this uh, this was a boon for me in disguise. I discovered the teacher in me. and i understood that teaching was the, the uh, teaching was a thing which i should have taken from in the first place instead right. of doing veterinary you should have gone for good that uh, destiny was playing up for me and made me the person today right and if i talk about the uh, like old story uh, there were only two options for a uh, army wife one is either they became a teacher or second is uh, like they can work in uh, army welfare societies like ava is there so they can yeah, go yeah. there and uh, work uh, so that was also an opportunity but that is restricted towards the skill you have like uh, women used to yeah. have a uh, skills related to crochet like uh, stitching and tailoring and those kind of things yeah actually um uh, now uh, these are the these uh, you are you are very right these are the these are the two opportunities which are available for which were available for women uh, in the army but uh, now uh, now the things have uh, are changing for good teaching is there teaching is still uh, one of the uh, one of the most uh, most of the army wives if you see are teachers because uh, that is I, I discussed earlier also it is easy. but now um, uh, army is doing a very good thing the skills that uh, the women who are having skills they are being promoted to become uh, ava entrepreneurs they are giving uh, they are they are being given a lot of platforms uh, wherein uh, they are they they are if they, they are given opportunity to exhibit their stuff uh, at uh, prime locations like malls like dlf mall in if you just take a piece of delhi uh, okay. like uh, dlf mall in basant gonj we had uh, even now i have also joined as an ava entrepreneur so okay. that is one of the best things which is happening in the army now women who are uh, who are uh, who are talented crafty they are giving they are given opportunity to exhibit their stuff at uh, malls at uh, uh, even the csd canteens they are also once in a while they are given opportunity to exhibit their stuff otherwise they, uh, they are they are organizing exhibitions for diwali for christmas for uh, navratri things are changing for good right. and uh, most of them are earning now and that they even uh, we had an exhibition the last day also where in my cup Hello, counterparts. There, one had bought who made a pickle. Okay. Uh, the other one, other other yeah, the other lady she had bought uh, candles, scented handmade candles, candy. handmade candles. Yeah, then some had bought crochet items like macrame items. They had at the store, and they 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 had a good exhibition. They had a wonderful exhibition. They earned quite a lot of uh, money in that exhibition. So, so things are changing for good in the army. That's great. That's, that's, that's great, that's great to hear yeah. about because uh, what we have seen, I told you about that. Now things are improving. and uh, yeah, yeah, ava yeah. is also supporting women that is wonderful thing yeah so, ava is moving back to you again if i talk about you are you an introvert or an extrovert kind of a person while uh, meeting or facing audience frankly speaking i am a very i am an extrovert that's what i first i am very comfortable when if i if i am made to go into a room with about 100 people whom i don't know i can easily gel up with people i don't have any problem uh, in that that's what i had thought about me. but uh, when i joined school uh, the teachers my counterpart they have a feeling that i am an introvert it was a very uh, 
मतलब इट वॉज वेरी कॉन्ट्रोडिक्टरी फीलिंग फॉर मी की अरे मुझे क्यों ऐसे लोग बोल रहे लाइक वेरी आई 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 कैन डेवलप विद पीपल सो वेल बट आई अंडरस्टूड वाई पीपल आई गेव इट अट की वाई पीपल आर थिंकिंग लाइक दैट अबाउट मी सो वेन आई थिंक अबाउट इट नाउ आई फील दैट वेन आई एंटर द स्कूल आई एम अ टोटली डिफरेंट पर्सन आई टोल यू आई एंटर द स्कूल आई फील दैट आई हैव जस्ट थ्री टू फोर आवर्स विद मी टू इन्फ्लुएंस दीज चिल्ड्रेन आई हैव टू मेक मैथ maximum utilization of those of that time so i even during break time i never used to go to staff room and sit there and have my tea i used to get the tea to my classroom so that wo jo khana kha rahe us time pe bhi main kuch rhyme gaati rehti thi so that they get they, they learn that on their own so maybe right. that is the reason that is the reason the teachers have always felt to those who have worked with me they have felt that alpana ma'am to bahut hi introvert hai they have a feeling like that but i feel that i am an uh, i am a pakka introvert i can i i love to interact with people so that's what i uh, that's what i think about it. great that's wonderful so uh, if i talk about the kind of support in your uh, journey so far who were the people supported you the most yeah uh, if you my i have uh, i have got, i have got a lot of support uh, from different people one is my friend uh, merl uh, who was with me uh, in kharagpur who gave me the right who, who diverted who was to mental in uh, diverting me diverting my job from uh, veterinary to becoming a teacher so uh, she really supported me she for she actually uh, was almost giving me sermons every day you have to do this you have to do this she found out all the things from uh, gathered all the information and every day she used to uh, put it in front of me see, see this now the course is going to start you have to do this you have to do that so she has been a great support for me uh, in my okay. life uh, next is my uh, partner who is the, uh, in my business who is there with me in my venture uh, priyanka is she like line folded she, she believes in me she feels that i can do Uh, i can do uh, whatever i do will be right so her uh, confidence in me always gives me the strength uh, has always motivate me to work work very hard because she trust she has trust in it blind trust in me. and um, last but not the least my family parents who, who uh, when i decided to uh, do this course my dad was the first person to call me and tell me that you just shift to my shift place i rest on the things i'll take care of uh, so my father my mother my in laws all were there to support me they took uh, took care because this course the teaching course you have to do camps you have to go to villages there's right. so there are a lot of things so they they took care of my children during those time and my sisters who are a constant who are constantly supporting me uh, who are my cheerleaders chahe main kuch bhi kar lo they feel that uh, she is doing something really great they tell this every day wonderful uh, and uh, last but not the least my husband he has been the greatest support uh, because once i got into this uh, uh, entrepreneurship there is there is no schedule Sometimes for uh, there is a photo shoot. The photographer is available only at nine nine o'clock. So from nine to one, we are shooting the stuff. All these things, um, it is it is very difficult because becoming an entrepreneur and and startup, you are you have that cash cr- cash crunch also. So you cannot uh, hire the hire. Uh, you cannot outsource everything. Correct. Many things you have to your mm-hmm. hands. So family family uh, supporting children is not at all possible in this situation. But my husband has re- taken care of everything. Taking care of the, the children when i am out of station uh, maybe i for book exhibitions i have to go for 7 days i am not in uh, delhi so uh, he takes care of children making the difference he was not such a person at all but he really shifted his uh, that has really amazed me the kind of change he has brought in himself to uh, support me uh, really, i mean uh, great behind every woman there is a man actually <laughs> correct so if i talk about motivation and inspiration how you get that my greatest inspiration has been my mother because if you see in the normal run she was a homemaker all throughout her life if you see there we, i have nothing to say that my mother this my mother did that my mother was this mother was that no but uh, she was not a very ambitious person that my children should become this my two girls should be a three sister my girls should become that she was not ambitious also but she gave such a secure life such a secure childhood that we three of us we are very emotionally stable people which is very 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 important uh, right. in life right. that is why i have been able to take so much of twist and turn uh, in my life otherwise i would have really got sh- gone shattered because there, there so much of changes have happened in my life but i was i am i am like very emotionally stable nothing affects ho jayega ho jayega aisa ek feeling hai because I've, uh, because you have a very secure uh, you got a very secure childhood that is very important if you have a secure childhood then only become a strong person and, and right. during this covid times also covid times also it was not very difficult for me are ghar ke andar hi baithna all these things ghar ke andar hi baithna itne sari cheez 
करना है घर घर के घर में बैठ के भी चाय लेने हम चले जाते थे सो वी हैव सीन इम वर्किंग डे इन डे आउट रात को भी बैठ के कर रहे काम सो दैट थिंग हेज ऑटोमेटिकली इम्बाइव इम्बाइव ऑल थ्री ऑफ अस वी वर्क वेरी वी हैव वी वर्क हार्ड इवन इनफैक्ट आर हस्बैंड से दैट जो पे है उसके हिसाब से नहीं काम करते ये लोग इनको उससे कोई मतलब ही नहीं होता है दे जस्ट वर्क लाइक वर्क लॉक लाइक डॉन की कैसे हमें बोलते हैं बट इट्स नॉट लाइक दैट वी हैव सीन दिस सो इट इज देयर इन आवर ब्लड एंड फॉर प्रोफेशनल लाइफ आई हैव सीन सो मेनी टीचर्स हैव गॉट टू वर्क विद इन डिफरेंट स्टेट्स ऑफ इंडिया टू हैव बीन मिशन द काइंड ऑफ वर्क दे आर डूइंग इवन when i was in kerala i was working in a government school i there was one teacher who used to uh, after school hours because i was working in a village i told you the children used to come in boats and all so they are coming from a very remote place so uh, and the parents are also not very rich and all they cannot afford tuition or they cannot uh, they they don't have even the, the knowledge to teach children so this teacher right. i have seen the class she used to sit for about 3 hours and take classes for all the children who were weak and leave them uh, home and also during saturday sunday she used to do house visit to and to those children who had some problems who used to behave so a bit differently in classroom to understand why they are doing why they are behaving like that so right. that was a great it was a great inspiration for me i have seen many teachers who are doing a wonderful job right. so they have been my inspiration. that's really wonderful so uh, if i talk about your take on success what do you think uh, success is to you success to me is if i am able to i will say i am successful i am able to do something uh, which i am very passionate about i am able to do a job which uh, which i am very passionate uh, about and that is success for me and uh, success for me is if i am able to inspire uh, people uh, through my work through my life then i'll say that i am a very successful person right uh, so this is my take on success and i am if i am able to do a very mentally contented life uh, not Correct. very not a materialistically material mai mai europe ja rahi hu mere paas ye hai mere paas wo hai no not that i i will say i am successful if i am mentally uh, very contented if i am very content with whatever i have in my hand now then Correct. i say that i am a very successful great so uh, moving on to the last one any advice or message you would like to share with our audience uh, the, i have discussed this already that success uh, sir, the, the things won't fall in place for you you have to change the course of your life move ahead move ahead in life Correct. and also stick on to your core value come what may maybe you may have to lose a lot of things for that but it's right. okay but it's totally okay stick on to that core value that will in the long run that will help you that will help you also right. uh, if you want to to run a uh, business or if you want to venture out into entrepreneurship try to come out of your uh, comfort as mm-hmm. soon as if you sit mm-hmm. in your comfort zone you there is no growth you cannot grow when you are in your comfort zone try to break your comfort zone break the barrier come out of it then you will see what a wonderful world is waiting for you definitely right? that is really important the more, the more fast you do that aap utna jaldi you will be able to uh, last but not the purely but we are human beings so we you should always try to try to collaborate with people uh, people around you are so wonderful you get to learn so much from people people will help you out instead of taking a negative stand to us because who are they are they try to find a positive thing in each and every person right. you will find you will uh, you will uh, you will be amazed how they can help you out hamare uh, even in this venture of ours we have hame koi desire chahiye tha hamare jo design karne ke liye we were searching for people i told you since it is a startup we cannot afford to pay Correct. that much Correct. so we सर्च कहाँ 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 सी थ्रू वर्ड ऑफ माउथ पीपल है अच्छा किसी ने कॉल किया है यहाँ पे uh, अच्छा आपके बारे में सुना था तो आई डू दिस आई कैन इज देर एनी जॉब फॉर जो अब हम ढूंढते हैं ऐसे किसी को तभी हमें मिल जाता है जस्ट बिकॉज पीपल आर कोलेबरेटिंग विद ईच अदर दैट इज द ओनली वे टू ग्रो सो wonderful having you here kalpana i really enjoyed our conversation and looking forward to hear more from you again soon uh, maybe uh, in kalpana
having time thank you so much for your time most welcome most welcome i also enjoyed it a lot uh, actually i was very anxious how i am going to even interview because this is the first time for me but but you really made me feel so comfortable and i uh, it was like a recap mere life ka ek recap jaise hi chala hai and it was a wonderful experience for me. wonderful so much and i will thank also you. share your social media link so that people can be in touch with you uh, see your uh, book uh, the kit and uh, how it can help their kids or maybe uh, to someone they know so that would be a help to them uh, so guys don't forget to check that out too thank you so very much everyone for watching and listening i hope you all must have gathered a lot of uh, valuable information and enjoyed watching it don't forget to like share and subscribe have a good time thank you bye bye